Assalamu alaikum welcome to Nasir Soft. In this video I will show it to you how you can uh, install and configure the code igniter 4 in XAM. Okay so I am using the windows uh, 11 okay uh, so my operating system is basically a windows and here whatever browser you are using open your browser and write code igniter and download okay. And this is the first official link uh, of the code igniter okay and here you can uh, click on this download and here the latest version of code igniter is code igniter 4 so press this download button in order to download the code igniter 4 and here you can see that the downloading is started and now completed okay so go to this specific link okay and this is the zip file uh, so open this inside the folder this is okay and extract this after extracting uh, it okay here basically this is the code igniter 4 framework okay the down it is downloaded so uh, rename it for example I named it a project for example code igniter 4 and basic okay so my project name is this cut this and inside go to inside your XAM installation location so my by default my XAM is installed in my C so inside the C this is the XAM and here this is the htdocs and inside the htdocs paste that folder okay so basically this is my local host okay so perfect so now open this inside your uh, editor so I am using this visual code so inside the visual code go to the and open folder and inside the open folder just go to that specific location okay inside the htdocs and this is the code igniter folder open this folder okay so this folder is open inside my editor that is a visual code so now what we do we will uh, basically start from here and now the only one thing is for example if I go to the browser here and open my local host okay first of all you need to install the XAMPP okay you need to start the XAMPP so this is the XAMPP and press on this start and the MySQL as well so now my server is running on my PC and now if I go to the local host and then that full fold project folder the project name is this okay so whatever your project name is on the browser after writing the local host here write this press enter so when I press enter so basically it goes inside this code igniter okay so now press or uh, go to this public link when I click on the public then this error is showing that is whoops we seems to have hit a snag okay so how we can fix this type of error this is very simple open your XAMPP uh, basically control panel again and inside this okay uh, click uh, at the, at the uh, front of Apache click on the configure and inside the configure this is the php.ini press on this and inside this php.ini here you need to search the okay here search the extension equal to init l press enter and here you can see that this is commented so remove this semicolon okay and save save the file close the file again uh, open your this dashboard of uh, XAMPP and inside this stop the Apache service and again start it okay so then when the Apache uh, is uh, successfully uh, started so close this one and here refresh this link as well here you can see that the code igniter uh, page is showing and here uh, how you can install the configure and install the code igniter 4.33 version so hope this video will help you a lot if you have any question regarding to this topic you can uh, comment inside the video comment section or uh, the question link is mentioned in the video description okay so just go to that specific question link login to my uh, website that is nasisoft.com and you can uh, question it directly to me and i will answer it to you don't forget to subscribe my channel for more informative videos stay blessed have a nice day